more than a year after the coronavirus pandemic began, we're just starting to understand how it affects people in the long term. Yeah, a new study found an alarming trend. About a third of COVID survivors had a brain or psychiatric disorder within six months, and I found out what you should look out for. While most coronavirus patients recover, we're getting a look at what they might run into months later. A new study published in the Lancet Psychiatry Journal found many coronavirus survivors are dealing with long-term neurological or mental disorders. University of Virginia infectious disease professor Dr. Bill Petrie says the finding is significant. We're just beginning to understand what the neurologic consequences are of COVID-19, and so this is a good first step. It found one in three COVID-19 survivors in a study of more than 200,000 patients had a brain or psychiatric disorder within six months, a majority of those cases pre-existing before COVID. But 12% of these patients received the first diagnosis of one of these disorders after getting COVID, with anxiety being the most common. What remains to be seen is how much of that is due to a direct effect of the virus, does the virus get into the brain and cause damage, versus how much of that is due to just being seriously ill and being in the hospital. Petrie says you should look out for your family members who have had COVID even months after. What's important is that whenever a family member is being discharged from the hospital is to talk to the nurse, talk to the discharging doctor, and kind of understand how is the illness impacted your family member. And it might be just being aware of uh, intermittent confusion. So this delirium that is such a problem in general with hospitalized patients. As some begin to see a light at the end of the pandemic, scientists are just beginning to get a clearer picture of COVID-19's long-term effects. Researchers at UVA have their own studies underway.